Oh, hello. Look, jelly mold hat. I'm excited and I'm scared. No, I didn't put my stuff away. All of the glam here this evening. Hello everybody, welcome back to another weekly vlog. Now, you guys know that I like to mix it up from time to time and sometimes do a little what I wore this week vlog. So because we're quite busy doing stuff for Black Friday, that is what I have decided to do this week. So let's start off with this sweater. It's like a really stretchy fabric. I'm not really 100% sold on the fabric as a winter sweater. I don't mind the fabric as a winter sweater. It's quite thin, but it's quite mild today. So I've got my coat on over the top. And as you can see there in the mirror, it's navy, white and red stripes. It's got a bit of a jazzy sleeve detail as well. It's kind of like a split sleeve. Sorry, I can't be bothered to take my coat off and show you. Um, but yes, that is the sweater, which I've tucked into my high-waisted jeans from H&M, which have got those shredded bits on the bottom. And then, I may as well do that while I'm down there. These are an old pair of tan suede boots, like sock boots from Zara. They go up to there and they've got this really jazzy heel, which is almost like flared. Uh, Judith my Loewe puzzle bag and then jewellery wise I've got on whoop, my Clouse watch and then this is my very fave my Monica Venada Mini Marie pendant and I've actually now got it on a Monica Venada chain this is the I think it's called the fine chain and I can't actually remember the length of this one but I will make sure that I link it in the description box below Earrings I have in the mix and match studs. So in this ear I have a moon and in the other ear it's a star. And then these are Misoma as well. The molten hoops in the medium size. And then here, while I'm here, I have some rings on. This is the magma ring. And then this one here is just like a kind of shield ring and that is from and other stories and the nail polish color that I have on is the one that I always wear throughout winter it's called got the blues for red and it's by OPI and my one is a gel but being OPI it does also come in a normal polish so that's it today's outfit I'm off to run some errands and then I've got a meeting this afternoon so this is what I'm wearing casual but warm and cozy and yeah practical right i am back home and i'm in my cozies the sweater is a very old one from a brand called jaeger um i've had this for about year and a half maybe um and i love it absolutely love it and it matches perfectly to these which are actually only a cashmere mix they're called a touch of cashmere and they are like a jogging bottom without the tie and they are from next and these are really really reasonably priced they do actually have a matching top which is called a tunic i'll link that below in the description box but when i got these the top was sold out so I've paired it with this also got my next like chestnut suede slippers and I've got my socks on because it's so so cold. Hey ho, it's Tuesday morning now and I am actually taking myself off for a girl's day with myself, the best kind of girl's day. So what have I got on? Right, let's start with the jewellery. So Mini Marie by Monica Venada and the horn necklace with the medium bubble chain by Misoma. Hope you guys managed to get hold of this Misoma necklace or some other Misoma goodies in the Black Friday sale. Then what else have we got? Right, the coat is the black one that I keep wearing from Bimba and Lola. I believe it's sold out online. I will keep checking and I'll always link everything below, but I believe it's sold out online. You can check in store, but I will also link some cheaper alternatives and just in general, some other alternatives to this one because it is a wicked coat and quite a good little staple to have in your wardrobe as well. Judith, Judith, Judith. And then my, oh, that's, I can't, it, it says, excuse me, I'm trying to show you. Excuse me, this is a black cashmere sweater with that little slogan on by Chinty and Parker. 
and then I've got my jigsaw straight leg jeans on these are the ones with don't know if you can see that kind of stripe that goes down the side love that and it's actually not that cold today so I'm gonna bear the ankles and then these are like my oxblood sort of burgundy color converse which I kind of forgot I had because I've been wearing the leather ones so I've whipped those out today and then also other jewelry is the misoma hoops which I keep wearing recently and then the studs behind usual watch and same jewelry as I had on yesterday so all of that will be linked below I've also got some lippy on today it's the bourgeois one so I will link that below as well ah, I'm all home showered warm in my cozies and it's only four o'clock <laughs> I'm a hundred percent one of those people that has a shower like in the middle of the day just to keep warm and this is what I have on my cozy attire so this is quite an old mohair mix sweater from and other stories and I love it because the sleeves are so long and it's so slouchy and then down here these are actual full cashmere they are technically pajama bottoms in fact I think did I yeah I think I featured these in my most recent haul, the winter haul, like packing haul. Um, and yeah, they are from Marks and Spencers. They are the Rosie for autograph range. And again, these do have a matching top with them as well, but I just got the bottoms because they were about a hundred pounds. Ah, <sighs> very expensive, but oh my gosh, so cozy. And then I have like the minky colour slippers on and because I'm that cold I've got thermal socks on I'm all about that cosy life and then obviously I have a towel on my head all of the glam here this evening hello everybody right as you can see I've been filming today but essentially I'll show you what this outfit is made of so I have my Zara Thin Knit from way back when in my first ever Zara haul. I'm still wearing it, can you believe it? Then here I have a plethora of Misoma goods. This is my new watch from Larson & Jennings. I bought that with the 40% off Black Friday discount and it just arrived today. I put it on straight away. It even has some of the plastic still on it, but I couldn't wait. Um, I've got my Misoma hoops, Misoma studs. Uh, this is a belt from ASOS. These are my <laughs> redone jeans, which I assure you they do fit. It's just not after choose on toast. And then I have some thermal socks <laughs> just to finish off the whole look. And that is what I've been wearing for the entire day. But right now, I just need some cashmere in my life. Hello, hello. Okay, it is Thursday. Yeah, Thursday. <laughs> I'm just completely losing track. The cold has taken over my body, including my brain. I'm gonna head out just to get some fresh air and some food. So I have got on my black polar neck sweater by Zara. This one is old, but I always link a mango version because it's identical. Long gray coat, and this is annoyingly flipped over because it's got like a two-tone belt this is by regina pio pio i still don't know how to pronounce it uh jeans with a frayed hem by and other stories and then i've got my anina bing sexy ass boots i think that's what we're all calling them now isn't it after last week's vlog and then my bag this is a very jazzy bag isn't it it's, I'm trying to show you the texture because it's velvet and it's one of those bags that's... Wait, let me just try and achieve this. It's like a shopper bag, but the way you carry it is by threading one... Oh, this is very difficult one-handed. Threading one handle over the other and then carrying it like that. That now makes me one of the cool kids. You know, and that is from mango so very affordable bag today judith is having a day off and uh yes yeah, today's rather cozy casual slouchy outfit 
I'll be back later, no doubt wearing the same cashmere jogging suit as I have worn all week. Right guys, I know this is an outfit vlog, but Bella's outside in the garden. I am here behind the safety of the door and she's just, she's just looking at me like, mum, will you let me in please? And this face was just too cute not to share with everybody. Oh, hello. Do you want to come in? You're wanting to come in? Yes? Okay then. Come on then. Bo's staying outside. She's got a lamb bone because we had roast lamb last night. So she's got the biggest bone ever. She's prepared to stay in the cold. Right, well as I suspected, I am indeed wearing the same cashmere as I've been wearing all week. Didn't show you guys earlier, but it is now half... It no, no, half ten. <laughs> I was going to say half eleven. I clearly can't tell time. Half ten, I am knackered, absolutely knackered, just because we've had a really busy day and I've been just staring at a laptop pretty much for the entire day. So I am going to take my makeup off, do all the good stuff, all the skincare routine, and I will check in with you guys in the morning with a new outfit, maybe. Or maybe I might just stay in bed. <laughs> Either way, I will see you then. Good night. Good morning, everybody. Today is Friday, Black Friday. And look at that. <laughs> I'm so dressed appropriately. Um, literally got up at like half seven this morning. That's a lie in for me because Simon had to take his mum to the airport at two o'clock in the morning. So had a bit of disruption in the middle of the night. So had a bit of a lie in. And then got up at half seven and started filming straight away. So straight away off came the PJs and into several different outfits. Um, but I'm just sitting down to do some work at the computer. So I've kept this on. Very kind of normcore casual. And look, <laughs> I've even got my mug, my motivational mug to spur me on for Black Friday. Um, the mug is from Next, by the way, in case anyone's wondering. And yeah, this is what I've got on. So I've got some old tailored trousers on from Jaeger, I do believe. I'll link alternatives below if anyone's interested. Uh, white leather converse, which I should really be wearing my slippers, but hey ho. And my Zara polo neck knit, because my cashmere one is in the wash. So yeah, a very norm call this morning. Got my hair scraped back. It's greasy AF and needs a wash. So gonna do a little bit more work and then hop in the shower. <sighs> Good morning, everyone. Saturday morning now, it's about 8.30. I'm out in the woods, walking the dogs on my own this morning because Simon's had to go and tend to my sister-in-law's dogs because we all look after each other's four-legged friends. Um, so later on today, um, I have my first ever meetup and it's being hosted at the Top Shop store in Knightsbridge, which is very exciting. I'm excited and I'm scared. I'm scared that actually all the people that arrange their tickets won't turn up for whatever reason <laughs> um so yeah we'll see how that goes um but i am in my dog walking outfit and so as the uh video is what i wore this week i'm going to show you so i have a hush cashmere scarf on for which i'm quite thankful i decided to throw on last minute because it is baltic outside and then i have this two-tone top shop parka which has a hood in here it's like folded up a bit like a packamac and then I have some hush jeans on and Timberlands dog walking attire complete with Timberlands so yeah I will catch up with you guys a bit later when I know what I'm uh, wearing for this event down the street just like I own it I'm rolling to the beach just like I wrote it Hi, I am dressed and ready so it'll be no surprise that I am wearing a checked blazer because you know I am Emma Hill and that is what I wear 
Got some Missoma, Monica Fanada, another Missoma necklace on. This t-shirt is from the boutique range. Then I've got some Jamie jeans on and these are in the like sort of black acid wash. And then I've got my Jill Sander boots which I had on this morning. And then my new Larson and Jennings watch, my Black Friday Triumph bargain. So yeah, I'm all ready for everyone. They're just setting up the other room. My heart is literally going I'm like, is anybody gonna turn up? Okay, I have just finished at the event and I realised that I forgot to show you guys what I actually wore to come in to Central this morning. So I've got my Ray-Ban sunnies, I've got my next coat on here, which you guys will have seen in Sunday's video. Jewellery, Missoma. Uh, Zara Thin Knit jeans are the ones I always wear from H&M. I've got an ASOS belt and my Loewe puzzle bag, Judith. And then shoes, hang on a minute, let me just casually jog. I have my Jill Sander gold heel boots on. And that is today's outfit. This coat is so warm. I feel a bit bad for being a little bit mean about it on uh, Sunday's video, because it is really warm. Morning guys. Sunday, we're out early with the dogs. So I have another dog walking outfit for you. We woke up and it was super frosty this morning, so I've had to up my coat game. And I've got my Zara aviator jacket on. This is basically the knockoff version of the acne velocity jacket i bought this last year but they bring it out every year um, and i'm wearing a size small just in case anyone's interested uh, and then i have on the same hush cashmere scarf as yesterday uh, hush jeans some thermal socks and my timberlands again and then also these thermal gloves which are about an inch too long for my fingers because I bought them in the men's size, not the ladies. Right, we've had a little bit of a clean. Huh? What did you clean? What did I clean? Yeah. I cleaned plenty of things. Such as? Such as the bedroom. So you mean you put your stuff away? No, I didn't put my stuff away. I hoovered and I've done the washing. Oh, right. Yeah. Pipe down. Anyway, got dressed because we're going to go out and do a little bit of Christmas shopping, which is... I think quite brave of us because it's a payday weekend and also it's Black Friday weekend and I just think that that's going to be asking for trouble. So this is what I'm wearing. I've got my uh, new Regina Pio. Pio. Someone told me how to pronounce this on my coat video and I've forgotten already. She said say it really quick. Pio. I don't know. Anyway, it's my new Regina Pio coat uh, with the flashy red belt. It makes me feel very not no, very nom, <laughs> very normcore. So that is kind of the general vibe of today's outfit. Got the usual polo neck sweater on. As you can see, I get plenty of wear out of this polo neck sweater. And they've got on some tailored trousers. Look at that, no denim. These are from Jigsaw. These are my Converse leather, uh, chuck tailors or i don't know whatever they're called and then this bag which i'm gonna just touch on is actually not celine i got this probably about three years ago it was from that website called jessica berman which i would not advise shopping on by the way uh, this broke after about two days but i really want a celine bag this is leather it's it's not it's not a fake but I guess it kind of is a fake. Like it doesn't have Celine written on it anywhere, but it obviously is identical to the box bag. Um, 
and I'm going to throw it away as soon as I find myself a genuine replacement because I've got my eye on a Celine box bag which is why I have kept this bag for so long but yeah I thought that would kind of complete today's outfit also got I've actually got no jewelry on other than my usual earrings but I do have my new Larson and Jennings watch and trying to do this one-handed never goes very well does it Emma yet we never learn my Celine these are called the baby Audrey's for anyone that's asking and that is today's look for going out shopping and ooh, ooh, also looking for new sofas which technically I think I've already found but just need to convince Simon that they're the ones <sighs> all right guys well I'm back in my, literally back in the same cashmere cozies again. So I'm not going to run through them. Same as before. Um, and I'm going to end this week's vlog here. Oh, hello. Hi, how are you? Oh, nice to see you. Thank you for coming. Um, and yeah, just a couple of reminders. So this weekend, I've got my last massive haul of the year as it's the first Sunday of the month. Okay, I'll keep stroking you. As it's the first Sunday of the month, of course, I always do a haul and this is the last one. So this is December's big haul. And then we're only two vlogs away from Vlogmas. So we're starting doing the 12 days of Christmas. Um, so that will be in a couple of weeks time and we're both very, very excited. We've got lots of fun stuff coming up, so. So yeah, that's it from me and I will see you guys this Sunday for the haul and then next week for another weekly vlog.